children good morning how are you all are you all doing good yes so in today's class we are going to do the remaining grammar part what did we do in our previous class tell me yes we did our lesson 2 what was the lesson name things i like yes yes did you all do the homework which i was which i have sent you did you draw the picture of a ball and a ball and then did you write the new words and word meanings you wrote very good i like you very much so you all wrote the homework very nice okay so in today's less in today's video we are going to write the question answers and the grammar part so shall we start yes children so open your textbooks page number 19 1919 19, 19, along with your pencils everyone okay children bye see did you all open your page number 191919 yes so today we are going to write the question and answers of this lesson what is the first question make a list of the things the poet likes to do so in this question you have to make all the things list of the things that the poet want to do in the lesson okay what did our poet want to do he wanted to read you have to write with pencil children i wrote with pen because you will not be able to see the video clearly if you if i write with pencil that is the reason i wrote it with pen but you all should write it with pencil okay children yes so what all the things the poet wants to do he wants to read right r e a d read then what did he want to do he wanted to write w r i t e right then run r u n run then fly the kite f l y fly t h e the kite k i t e kite then you put you have to put the commas between each and everything okay then what else he wanted to do he wanted to walk yes w a l k walk then he wanted to hike h i k e hike then swim s w i m swim then dive what is diving it is jumping into the water d i v e dive then ride the bike r i d e ride t h e the bike b i k e bike and drive d r i v e drive so these are all the things the poet want to do in the lesson yes okay now coming to our second question what is the second question what things can the poet do inside the house what we can do inside the house we can read write walk and run yes r e a d read right r e a d read then write w r i t e right then walk w a l k walk and run r u n run we can do all these things inside the house correct yes now third question what are the things she cannot do inside the house where can she do those things okay what she cannot do inside the house ride a bicycle we cannot ride a bike r i d e ride a bike b i k e bike here r is not there children by mistake i have written b i k e bike then ride a bike we cannot ride a bike inside a house correct yes then swim s w i m swim then dive d i v e dive and drive d r i v e drive 
we cannot do all these things inside the house and where we can do she can do s h e she can do them outside on road we can ride the bike and we can drive on the road and we can do swimming and diving in swimming pool so she can do it outside on road and in swimming pool okay next fourth question make a list of things you want to do now what do you want to do you want to ride you want to swim and you want to ride a bike yes and even you want to paint yes of course you want to paint also next name some things that you can do only when you grow up the things which you can do only when you grow up you cannot drive now you have to grow up for that and even you cannot die it is only for elders so drive d r i v e drive comma d i v e drive these two things can be done only in when you grow up okay children now turn your page page children to page number 20 yes so now we are going to do the grammar part so what is there in this page we will see see my father drives a red car yes yes and so here if you see drive it is some action driving and here also ride it is also some action so these type of words are called as action words or verbs so here in this next pair next sign next bit we are going to circle the correct action word for each sentence so what will be the correct action word we will see i dash to the park do you walk to the park or do you ride to the park correct you walk to the park so circle walk here okay next second one sahil and kate dash basketball together what will come here as it come play or run yes they play basketball together third one if you see i wear shorts in summer it this is the correct answer so you circle the wear you do not drive shorts you wear shorts similarly if you see one day i will dash up the hill do you fly up the hill or hike up the hill yes you hike you walk up the hill no so you hike up the hill my friends dash the piano my friend plays the piano my friend eats the piano is wrong my friend plays the piano next mia dash at scholastics okay mia works at scholastics okay now sam dash orange juice sam drinks orange juice okay children understood this page so all these words which are doing actions are called as action words first one walk second one play third one read fourth one wear fifth hike sixth play seventh is work and eighth is drink okay so we will go to next page now okay now next page number 21 we are going to see the 
सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस वॉट इज सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस द सिंपल वर्क विच यू डू डेली ओके यू आर डूइंग डेली वर्क द सिंपल वर्क विच यू डू डेली दे आर कॉल्ड एज सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस लाइक वॉक इट इज अ सिंपल थिंग यू वॉक डेली इट इज अ हैबिट इट इज अ सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस आई वॉक टू स्कूल एवरी डे हियर वॉक इज अ सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस द थिंग्स द वर्क विच यू डू डेली दे आर कॉल्ड एज सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस सो वॉट आर सिंपल प्रेजेंट टेंस the words the word the words which tells us about the actions okay like walking talking reading swimming okay all these things are called as verbs all verbs are simple present tense words that tell us what a person or an animal or a thing does are called as doing words or action words or verbs so we use these verbs in simple present tense understood so whatever actions you are doing they all are called as verbs and these actions come under simple present tense understood what are simple present tense simple present tense are actions that we do daily okay children so in this grammar portion we are going to see what are the verbs in simple present tense circle the verbs in simple present tense so first one what is the first one i brush my teeth every day so here brush is a work you are doing the work no brushing means you are doing the work so you circle the brush second one the school closes in may every year closing here closing is also work okay so it is all it it also comes under simple present tense so you circle close third one we wash our hands before meals so wash is also a action so you circle the wash fourth fifth fourth one dad drives to work every morning here drives driving is a work it comes under simple present tense okay simple present tense are simple works which we do okay drive last one i talk to grandma on the phone every friday in this sentence what is the work yes talking is a work so talk is a simple present tense understood so first one brush second one close third one wash fourth one drive and fifth one talk understood children everyone so with this you are going to complete today's video is with this with this one i am going to close today's video and in our next class we are going to do the remaining portion okay for today we have completed till page number 21 okay children okay for today's homework you read Okay, again you read. I'm not giving you any writing work. Only read, read the class work, learn the class work. Okay, children. 